Greetings YouTube, family, friends, and survivors. I put a little uh, downturn on the exhaust pipe coming out of the 24 volt gas generator. And I'll go in and show that to you in just a minute. And I have some final results that are semi-scientific as to its fuel efficiency. So I'll go in and show you the generator, then I'll explain what I mean, hopefully very briefly. Okay, I had it set at 2100 RPM and I can see that the washing machine in the house we just went into the agitation mode and I could hear the engine working a little bit harder and the amps went from 10 amp output on the amp gauge to 12. Now it's up to 15. Okay, I wanted to explain the test that I did. What I did is I did a test at nighttime so that the solar power wouldn't interfere. And I ran the diesel, that gas generator out of fuel. And then I put in exactly one quart. And when I started it, it was running at 10 amps and I wanted to have the amps typical throughout the test to be as scientific as possible. So it was running at 10 amps at nighttime, not much going on in the house, but when the refrigerator or the freezer kicked on, it would go up to about 15 amps. And then as soon as they would kick off, or, and they, they usually don't come on at the same time, but it could happen. When they kick off, it goes back to 10 amps. So I did a test, exactly one quart, and it ran two and a half hours on a quart. The RPM was set at 1800 and it did very, very well, I think, if you figured out a uh, quart is a quarter of a gallon, two and a half hours uh, on a quart is the same as uh, 10 hours on a gallon. So 10 hours per gallon at 10 to 15 amps is really pretty amazing. That's way better than I thought it was. When I had tested it before, uh, it ran about five and a half to six hours. And you know, sometimes I'd miss a little bit. When did that thing really turn off? You know, that kind of thing and guessing. But this time I had the door open on the house. So the moment the thing turned off, I looked at the clock and it was uh, two hours and 27 minutes on one quart out of 10 amps at 24 volt. So I was very impressed with it. And so some of you have wanted to know, I threw the figure out there five and a half to six hours. Well, it's actually much higher than that. You could see that that is a Honda knockoff. It's a Predator sold at uh, Harbor Freight. I bought it for $99. So here in this application, I'm burning junk fuel like out of a lawnmower or a parked car you're going to park a car for the winter and you don't want to leave the fuel in it all winter long to go bad so it really essentially it's fuel that would have gone bad so it's kind of free fuel but not and i'm able to burn it uh, even when it gets bad and it gets old although we do treat all the fuel around here i'm able to burn it in that predator engine which is a 99 dollars engine and that saves the wear and tear on the diesel, which is a $2,000 engine. So there you have it, two and a half hours 
on one quart at 1800 RPM at a 10 amp average at 24 volts. Pretty good. All right. Have a blessed day.